How's it going out there, guys and gals in sporting land? This is uh, JPC. I am the OCF. I am the outlaw of college football, and you guys and gals make this thing go because you are the home of the common Joe and common Sally in the know, even more so than especially all those media talking heads. Now, just want to jump in here real quick. I was out and about driving, doing a little Ubering today, get a little extra cash, and then I saw this, I heard this story notified me that... Uh, Alabama has actually had a couple of big names enter the transfer portal after their championship game loss last night. So I pulled over here at the federal courthouse here in Tuscaloosa, Alabama, as you can see. <laughs> because I want to let y'all know what was up. <laughs> That's right. Um, three big names for certain have put their name in the transfer portal. Paul Tyson, backup quarterback for Alabama, no surprise there. But the other two did surprise me a little bit, I must say. Drew Sanders and Jaleel Billingsley both have entered the transfer portal. Drew Sanders showed a lot of promise early on, got a little nicked up. That made way for Dallas Turner and other players to get in the fold, and they never let go. And that's the thing when you play for a big-time school like Alabama, a Power 5 school that's in the top five in recruiting all the time. If you get nicked up, man, you may never get your spot back. So... You see a lot of this transfer portal stuff now, especially with the big-name teams. Um, Tommy Brown and King Makuta were two other guys that entered the transfer portal as well from Alabama. They didn't have as much of an impact on the team. But I will be really interested to see where Jaleel Billingsley, Drew Sanders, and Paul Tyson end up. Especially Jaleel Billingsley, in my opinion, was a real good tight end. He just had some off-the-field issues, I think. Um, had some situations that uh, got him in the doghouse a few times with Coach Saban, I think. But overall, great talent. Whoever gets him, uh, it's going to be a huge get. But just like getting you a five-star tied in in the recruiting process. Drew Sanders, another big name to me. Guy showed lots of promise, got nicked up, as I said before. Uh, where these guys end up. Your guess is as good as mine. Now, Paul Tyson, he's a quarterback. It's easier to um, try to guesstimate where Paul Tyson would go because he's a quarterback. Uh, numerous teams need a quarterback. Uh, Paul Tyson may elect to stay in state. I don't know. I mean, he is from Alabama, and he may just decide to transfer to a smaller school like UAB, Sanford, or Troy State would be, I think UAB would be a good spot for him, but he may have his eyes on a bigger prize. There may be a program out there, too, that may be looking for a quarterback of his uh, talents. He's a real good in-the-pocket kind of quarterback. He never was really given much of a chance out here. So I'm hearing, you know, there's a lot of teams out there. He sort of entered the transfer portal a little late, I think. He should have probably entered his name a lot sooner. Um, but you guys and gals tell me out there, uh, who out there, Needs a quarterback. Who's really hurting for a quarterback right now? Drop it in the comment section and let me know. And with that, I'm going to get off here. Just want to drop in here real quick and drop that breaking news on you guys and gals because y'all deserve it. And like, share, comment, and subscribe. And as always, KMCA to all the other teams.